Welcome back. I hope you found page 50 in your math book. It look, should look like this page right here. So we are going to solve an enough for the class problem. Now what we're going to do is we're going to take a look at this bag. Bag A. And bag A is filled with blocks. So I want you to take a, just a quick look at bag A, look at the front, and I'll flip it over, look at the back of bag A, and think to yourself, wow, hmm, is that going to be enough blocks for everyone in the class to have one block? We're going to approach this sort of like a scientist, so think to yourself, let's make a prediction right now. You think to yourself, is that going to be enough? Yes or no? All right, make a prediction. All right, let's start with the first question we have here, which is, there are how many children in our class? Well, we figured that out in our last video. Does anyone remember? I hope you're nodding your head, and I hope you're remembering it's 17. So there are 17 children in our class. Now, the next question you're asked is, I counted the, the blocks in bag what? Well, we're going to be using bag A. So we need to figure out how many cubes, sorry, I keep calling them blocks, but how many cubes there are in the bag. So let's dump these guys out and let's count them as we put them back into the bag. Can you count them with me? One two, three, four, whoops, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Hmm. So how many cubes are there all together? There are 19. Hmm. Question number four says, are there enough for the class? Well, we know that there are 17 children in our class, and we know that there are 19 cubes. So you first have to ask yourself, is 19 more or is 19 less than 17? I hope you're thinking more. That's one of our sight words this week. More. It's nine, there are, 19 is more than 17. So if the number, if we have more cubes than children, are there enough for the class? You should be sitting, nodding your head. Yes, there are enough for the class. Okay. Now the question here is, were there any extra cubes? Well, we know we only have 17 students. We know we have 19 cubes. So we already said we have more cubes than, than children. So now we need to think, hmm, how many more are there? Are there any extra cubes? Well, we already know the answer to that question is yes. We do not know the answer to how many there are. So let's get our cubes out of our bag, pull out the 17 for each of the children in our class, and then see what's left over. That's how we're going to solve it this time. And then in our next video, we're going to talk about other ways to solve the problem. So we're going to pull out 17. There's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, and 17. So that takes care of all the students in our class. And then let's see how many extras we have left. How many do we have left over? Well, there's this many left over. So how many is that? Two. So we have two cubes left over. Two cubes that are extra. And our next question is, do you need more cubes? Well, we said no, we had extra, so the answer would be no. And then finally, how did you figure it out? Show your work. 
So I'm going to ask you to take a few minutes right now and figure out how you would show, draw a picture, how you would show that there are 19 blocks but only 17 children and that we would have two left over. So take a few minutes, complete that, then make sure you tear out the page, put it in your orange folder to return to your teacher.